welcome to my channel. This is the first installment of my new series, which is all about uh, tarot spreads and uh, basically just me reviewing them, uh, showing you how they're done and if they're any good, if they're a little too much, if they're not enough, and just giving you uh, an overview of them. So let's start off with the basics. Um, the first type of tarot spread that you normally start off with and then we'll just work our way from there. So why did I wave at you guys? I don't know why I waved. So let's uh, start off from there. And uh, yeah, let's, let's start. Okay guys, so we're gonna do the basic tarot spread. Nothing really special. I'm just gonna, ah! I'm just gonna do a just standard three card spread which is what everybody starts off with most of the time. Majority of us do anyways. Okay. If not that, it's the one card spread, which is basically the one that you do every morning. Ah, this is what happens when you talk and you're doing this at the same time. Okay. And I'm trying to do this with my arms extended quite wide. So bear with me. Here we go. Okay, I always do one of those every every reading. So we're just gonna do ooh, the Emperor, the Sun, the Two of <coughs> Swords. Oh, excuse me, guys. I have a really bad cough. I haven't been able to get rid of it. Okay, so here we go. This is what we got. So yeah, we've got the Emperor, we've got the Sun, and we've got the Two of Swords. Okay, here's how it goes. Usually this spread is your past, your present, I mean, yeah, your past, your present, and your future. Uh, it's very simple, as you can tell. Uh, this is what happened in the past, this is what's happening to you right now, and this is what's gonna happen to you if you continue on this path, okay? Now, if you read it like that, then this would be the emperor, okay? The past is you had someone, a male, who was very powerful, who was very um, masculine and controlling and knew what he wanted and knew how he wanted it and he was very, very powerful. That could be either a father or yourself if you happen to be male or maybe you're female but you just have like this very powerful personality. So yeah, that's, I mean, you could read it in several different ways. Mind you, this is a major arcana so it's, um, more predominant it's something that's more instilled in a person or yourself or your atmosphere uh, where the minor is more of a passing thing it's more of a temporary thing it's more of a little thing in your life kind of a thing okay so you have that so in the past you could say something along the lines oh you had a a very uh, predominant male figure that was very um mind you i'm not reading these cards psychically i'm just telling you I'm just telling you what what a way of uh, like I'm explaining how you can read a three card spread I'm not reading the cards themselves I'm not reading psychically okay so you know you have that and then you have the male figure the very powerful male figure who's very controller this could be like a, a, a boss a father just somebody in that na in that type of um, nature very powerful very uh, uh, dominating person um, hence why he's the Emperor then you have the Sun which is your present so the present would be that you're very <coughs> that it's very wonderful it's very sunny it's very you have everything under the Sun you're walking on sunshine you know that's the the, the idea and you have to connect these two so you could say something along the lines or the way that you could connect them is this got you to this. So because of the fact that you had a very, let's say you had a very predominant father who was very, uh, uh, not necessarily controlling, but let's say, mm, um, a very powerful figure in your life. And because of the way he taught you and uh, molded you, you are now walking on sunshine. You have everything you want. You're very content with what you have. Um, he, you know, he guided you in the right direction. And then we come into the future, 
which is the two of swords. And for me, the two of swords is just basically indecision when it comes to thinking. Um, and the way that you can connect them is basically the same. It's like from here, you went, he you're going here because this is where you were. And from here, because of this, what happened here, you got to this, you got to this. And then because of where you are right now, and if you keep going where you are right now, you're going to end up here. You're going to get this. Remember how, and, and, and here, like, yeah, notice how I'm saying it because you're here. And if you keep here, you keep going on this path, this is what's happening. This is what's going to happen. Now, I've always said nothing is written in stone. Everything changes. So when you get over here, you have indecision. So you could be something along the lines of, oh, um, wow, indecision. Uh, let's say you're walking on sunshine. It's wonderful and great, but you have not made any choices because the emperor has gave you everything and gave you everything of how to be and how to, how to, how to do things. And you're kind of walking on sunshine. You don't have any cares. And because of that, certain things are going to pile up and you're going to have to make that decision, make that decision that you are not, um, probably not even aware of that you have to make. And that's what you're getting. You're, you know, you're getting to that, but it is a, minor arcana so it's not that big <coughs> it's something small it's something smaller um because you know these are major so they're more uh, predominant and, and and in your life um so that's how the the three card spread pretty much works so basically this is your past this led you here and this is where you're at right now and then if you keep going here, you're going to end up here. Um, so yeah, that is basically the simple way of doing a three card spread, or the, at least the way that you have to understand that it's past present. And because of this present, if you keep going, you're going to end up here. That's how I always see it. Um, also with a three card spread, sometimes I've done three card spreads that are just on the present. They are not on past, present or anything or future. It's more of like just three cards that tell me what's going on right now. Uh, and that is really up to you. I mean, if you mentally think to yourself, okay, the next, I'm going to take out three cards while you're shuffling. I'm going to take out three, three cards and that's what's going on right now in my life. Then that's what's going on right in your life. It's not going to be past, present and future. Only if you know that that's what's going to happen. Like, I mean, if that's going to happen, if you know that that's how you're going to, to read them. Okay. And it still works still the same. Um, there's no, there's no problem with that. There's no issue with that. You can do it however you like it. Um, but this is actually a very good spread for somebody who is starting off. It's kind of like the go-to spread for everybody. Um, on occasions, you can take out another card, maybe put it on top of one of the other cards if you want to have more clarity of what is going on. Um, but yeah, that's that's what that's the simple. Ah, why am I moving it? Uh, that's a simple uh, three card spread. Um, I highly recommend it for people who are starting off um, and you're not um, comfortable with any of the spreads. The only thing I will say about this spread is that it's kind of addicting. So if you do do this spread, try to start, like after you get comfortable, get to doing other spreads. Okay, guys? Because after a while, this one becomes sort of like your go-to and, well, for me anyways, and you have to open yourself up to, to other spreads. Well, you don't have to, but it'll be good um, and you end up learning more about the cards. Okay? Um, so yeah, that is my review of the three card spread. Uh, if you guys have any questions, please let me know. Uh, any suggestions on any spreads that you want to know. Uh, if you do want to know about a particular spread, please leave me a link to the spread so then I can see it clearly. Don't just give me a name because then I won't know what spread you're talking about because some spreads have like five different names and it's the exact same thing uh, because people like to be original and say that they created it when they didn't. But anyways, 
Um, so yeah, just let me know. And other than that, that'll be all for today. Have a nice day, guys, and uh, many blessings, and I'll see you guys around. Toodles! <laughs>